Yeah, I, I'm really again. We're really excited to have you here because um, your, your sound, you just have, you just have that kick, you know, like from your samples, the way you uh, you you flip things and and your your 808s and your low end. I you know selection. We come from the production world, so I'm really hyped to to have you here and just you know just pick your brain and see what you're up to. Um, I could tell you produce on uh, FL Studio, right? Mm -hmm. And I see you here with the PCs because uh, I know it works better with you know with uh, the PC computers. Mm -hmm. um, when you're creating a beat, what's what's usually your your, your process and, and and you usually start off with the sample first or you start off with drums? Um, yeah, I never start off with drums. I yeah. usually just start off with the sample uh -huh. or like I make like a melody um, idea and then add drums later. Yeah, and yeah. And I I know you've been producing since you were nine and mm -hmm. you're currently nineteen, so ten years, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's amazing. Um, I was reading how. You uh you started your your grandparents correct gave you a, a, uh, a yeah a yeah my key, grandma yeah yeah the mm -hmm. grandmother gave you a keyboard yeah and then is it true that you were watching um, Timbo and Jay uh, uh yeah um I was watching yeah Timbo and Jay uh from the Black Album documentary yeah crazy. um yeah that video really inspired me <laughs> yeah uh, you know I, I'm curious uh have you have you heard recently what uh what Timbo said about you know about producers. Uh, yeah, yeah, I saw like a link on Twitter. I didn't open it though. Yeah, yeah. I, I actually have the what he says. He, um, he was on with Ebro actually, who's on uh, Beats One, mm -hmm. and he uh he says I don't think we have producers anymore. He says I think we have great programmers. Beats are not made how we used to do them. He's all he says I think they come as a package. The looping is for you to figure out which program it, it runs through to trick it out and to make something that once was uh to be something totally different and he was just explaining how he takes patterns layers and blends the colors mm -hmm. and then he was also talking about how people don't even know how to make their own snares or drums anymore but he did kind of come off a, a bit confident like there's no such like there's no producers anymore and then um you know the, also the topic of how engineers kind of pick up for producers and and kind of make them you know to seem what they are to be what, what do you think about that statement um i mean uh, I guess I kind of, like, I, I, I disagree and I agree with uh -huh. him. Um, no one really makes their own sounds anymore unless they're really interested in it. Yeah. Um, because there's so many, there's so many things out there that, that can help them, you of know, course. like no one wants to make their own sounds anymore, yeah. really. Yeah. But I mean, I wouldn't say that we're yeah. not producers. I, I, I feel you on that. I, I mean, yeah. even from us, from coming from our world too, I feel like I, I see I mean, not, I, I got to agree, like, especially a lot of the SoundCloud world, mm -hmm. a lot of these kids, you know, um, they don't really know how to engineer, but I know they do their best. And there's other artists who do, like, they do everything yeah. on their own because they can't afford to go to the studio exactly. and have an engineer and, or pay for sessions. So, yeah, I think I think there's some, you know, truth to what he's saying in terms of, and what about in, in terms of the engineer side, um, like, who who's a, do you work with the engineer usually or do you kind of engineer all your own music? Yeah, I don't usually work with an engineer. I okay, have, yeah. everything on your own. Yeah, tight. And one thing I also like about you too, aside of your humbleness, is how you, um, you know, it's like obviously you, there's not many females in the game that produce and mm -hmm. that are in this field. Mm -hmm. But what I like about you is like you don't make it about a gender thing. It's just yeah. like yo, I'm a human being making yeah, exactly. music. I'm just a person. <laughs> like don't look at me for who I am it's yeah. just like I make music but I think it's tight cuz there's not that many of you and again you make you make like if we are talking about a gender then you make beats that hit harder than most dudes mm -hmm. you know like you, you give Metro Boomin a run for his money <laughs> and Lex Luger and all those cats you know from back in the day that are like responsible for this this hard hitting sound